Hi, my name is Lisa and I'm with Ava Ministries and today I would like to talk to you about the covenant of God. The covenant of God, there are actually eight of them in the Word of God and the one this evening I would like to talk about is number eight and that would be the new covenant. The new covenant consists of 3,000 promises. It consists of salvation, deliverance, healing, restoration, correction, blessing. It consists of you coming to know who God is in the truest form. It consists of you getting to know that Jesus is God's son and that one day we become the bride of Christ married to Jesus. It consists of us, on the other hand, and this is what God expects us to do in this covenant, is be obedient, surrender, spend time with Him, um, read the Word, meditate on the Word, and a whole lot more. But in this covenant, God is going to explain to you why you're sick, and what your sin did, and what, um, and it's kind of, He's going to show you when you committed all these sins, this is what happened to your body. He's going to show you what you have to do to get rid of the sin. And then he's going to apply the blood of Jesus to your sickness and heal that body part. And if he needs to, he will send a new body part. There are body parts in heaven, but that's in the new covenant. Yes, that is what you are entitled to in the new covenant. And in this new covenant, all the promises are yes and amen, but there are conditions to this new covenant. It's called obedience. It's called surrender. It's called spending time with God. And as and the deeper and the more time that you spend with God, the deeper you go, and the more he starts calling you son and daughter, the more the deeper you go, the more you're like, it's like God's like a magnet. You can't let him go. Nope. And then he will start teaching you that you'll, you'll start growing. It'll become a journey. And then he'll, he'll take you through a different process to where maybe one day he'll put you in ministry. Or, and if you don't go into ministry, maybe he just wants you to pray for your family. And he wants all of us to pray for our families. Not everybody will go into ministry. But there are things God will have you do, even as the apostle says, the towel service of the church. It's not a problem. Me, I'm an evangelist. But if God asked me to be in the towel service, you better believe it, I'd do it. And yes, I would. So, now, if you want to know God as a father, and if you want to know God more and, and know more about your covenant, because I can tell you everything but it would take a couple hours the best way to find out who god is is first receive him as lord and savior when you receive him your covenant begins so let's talk about that so how about we set aside things receive him as savior and i'll hook you up with the church or our church actually because we teach on covenant we teach about the times the seasons we teach about everything and God will show you everything you need to know but you have to surrender you have to say yes in order for your covenant to be activated today you have to surrender you have to invite him into your heart Jesus must be the Lord of your life and there's no other way to go because one day ladies and gentlemen it's going to be too late and we don't want it to be too late so bow your heads and let's let's uh, receive him as Lord dear Jesus be my Savior forgive me of my sins and I repent of everything I've done I ask you to show me the covenant teach me your ways Show me this covenant. Teach me. Grow me. Take me on a journey. I ask that you be my father. And if you've repeated that prayer, well, congratulations.
And if you want to know more, on Sunday morning at 10 a.m., we have church service. And Friday night, 7.30, we have a Shabbat service. Listen, we're, um, we're a church of nations. It's not just any one group. There's Spanish, there's English, and others. And God says we're to be brothers and sisters no matter what. So, our address is 2220 East Arlo Bronson Highway, Kissimmee, Florida. Now, if you want directions or need a ride or you want help finding another church, give me a, just put something in the comment and we'll hook you up. All right. Have a blessed day.